All right, I showed you guys this earlier when I had it taken apart, showed you kind of the breakdown of the Vassvarn M1911, right? So I wanted to paint it up nice, be kind of a candy paint red. I had to do a couple different things here. First, the candy paint that I use is not dark enough when there's graphics. So even if I clean it off with acetone, they just don't cover. So I had to go to a different red and then hit that red with the candy paint. And since I wanted to do a black tip here, I actually did some taping off so that we could have that black here. And it turned out pretty well. Um, not, I wouldn't say perfect, but very good. Definitely as good as the factory um, you know, jobs are on these type of blasters. So that's cool. So you can see here this barrel attachment, right? I did go ahead and glue on this one because there was no good way to affix it. This does have an extended inner barrel that reaches all the way into the gun and goes over the top of that interior barrel. So that helps with stability too. And then, you know, that's, that's pretty much it. I had put a larger capacity battery in here because this is the one where it just charges off the plug, right? So you can put another battery in here and it'll certainly work, but the battery that's in here is one where it charges and powers off this same plug, okay? It doesn't use this white plug. There's not even a white plug there. And I certainly could have rewired this, done another plug to the white set to this, and had a separate one. It was just easier to put the other battery back in there. It wasn't gonna make any difference in FPS or anything anyway. So here it is, the 1911 from Vassvarn. We'll shoot it later, but, I think it turned out pretty nice, so.